Hey guys, it's me, Miss HCG Girl, and I'm checking in to show you something that I learned from another HCGer, and that would be Hebby Dobby, whom I miss and I love very much. But she had mentioned in her vlogs early on in her HCG journey that she takes True to Truvia that you can get at Walmart, at your local grocery store. It's basically granulated, sugar-free uh, stevia with erythritol. Basically, it's sugar-free sweetener. And you can turn this granulated stuff into powdered sugar. And I'm going to show you how with my Vitamixer, okay? Um, the Vitamixer that I got, uh, I ended up buying a dry container, and it also comes with a wet container. I suggest if you have a dry container, you use the dry container. If you have a high-powered blender like a Ninja or some other brand, it will work. It just might take a little longer. And when I start this, I'm going to have my husband time, or I can time it on my iPhone, uh, exactly how much time it took me to grind this powdered sugar up in the Vitamixer, okay? So this is a plug for Vitamixer, even though I don't get paid any endorsements or I'm not even an affiliate, I'm doing this uh, to let you guys know. So what I want you to do is, uh, you know, if you don't know anything, we're going to use this sugar, sugar-free substitute, and some recipes that I make. And so what I want you to do is I went ahead and dumped mine out, and it's almost one and a half cups. It comes right below it, okay? So we're going to take the one and a half cups of Truvia, which is about $6, $5.98 at Walmart, and we're going to pour it in our Vitamixer, okay? And this is how easy it really is, folks. The Vitamixer here has some buttons on the front, and I use this thing every day for various things. Um, so anyway, what we're going to do is we're going to start it on low, and then we're going to crank it up to high. But I'm going to edit out the sound right here so you won't be... It's pretty loud. <laughs> okay, folks. Uh, you, I'm, since the sound was edited out, um, and I started my timer like five seconds into it, uh, my husband reminded me. Thank you, son. And uh, you may have noticed that there was a little bit of smoke. And if I pull this plug out right away, there's going to be smoke. It's going to be smoking, okay? So, just warning you, because I have done this many of times for my Chocolate Delight recipes, and the recipe I'm getting ready to show you, you will need powdered Truvia in it, or some kind of sugar-free sweetener that melts really easily. So, um, right now, I'm going to open the lid, and you'll be able to see... What happens once you powder your sugar in the Vitamixer? It's pretty powerful. Woo! See this? It looks like we have a smoke machine, okay? And I absolutely love the smell of this. And I don't know if my husband can catch this or not. It looks exactly like powdered sugar that you buy at the store that's white processed sugar, except this is a sugar-free substitute. So what I want you to do after that is uh, you can pour it in a container. I normally keep mine in like an old Faye container. And that way, you know, when you need a cup or half a cup or whatever, this was a, a cup and a half before processed, and it probably makes more than that after. But for our recipe, we're going to be using it all here in a little bit. So... Anyway, I hope I helped you out, and I hope you try this, and... Um, and I'm not encouraging people to go uh, buy a Vitamixer if you don't have the money to buy a Vitamixer. But if you do get one, it's very handy dandy. I have used it for many, many, many things. So, this is Miss HCG Girl saying here's how we make powdered sugar-free substitutes. Peace out.